A powerful new telescope in Outback Australia has mapped vast areas of the universe in record-breaking time, revealing a million new galaxies and opening the way to new discoveries. Marvi Delfin from Western Australia will give us the details live. Marvi? CATH, the Australian Square Kilometre Array Pathfinder or ASCAP, developed and operated by Australia's National Science Agency CSIRO, successfully mapped approximately 3 million undiscovered galaxies in just 300 hours or 12 and a half days. CSIRO astronomer and lead author David McConnell called it a significant milestone for the radio telescope and the science community. The radio telescope located in Geraldton, Western Australia, has created a Google map of the universe from 903 radio images in record-breaking speeds compared to previous surveys which have taken years. The survey spent just 15 minutes observing each part of the sky, with the final images revealing twice the level of detail compared to previous survey results. Each of the 903 images contains 2,000 to 4,000 objects, with the survey covering 83% of the sky. The final 903 images and supporting information amount to 26 terabytes of data. ASCAP's key feature is its wide field of view, generated by 36 dish antennas and CSIRO-designed receivers, allowing it to quickly take highly detailed panoramic pictures of the sky and detect faint light from very far away. On a statement yesterday, CSIRO Chief Executive Dr. Larry Marshall said, ASCAP brought together world-class infrastructure with scientific and engineering expertise to unlock the deepest secrets of the universe. The new data generated from the radio telescope will enable astronomers to undertake statistical analyses of large populations of galaxies in the same way social researchers use information from a national census. Minister for Industry, Science and Technology Karen Andrews said ASCAP is another outstanding example of Australia's world-leading radio astronomy capability and inspiration for deep space discovery for the next generation. Kath? Thank you, Marvi, for that report.